here at 7 in the morning, um, and so was like the entire dorm. A day thousands of students, like Sally McPhee, have been getting ready for all summer. This is a lot more chill, a lot more relaxing. Uh, it went a lot smoother than I was expecting. I thought it was actually going to be a lot more messy and confusing. It actually went a lot more smoothly than I thought. I think I exceeded expectations for sure. The process made easier in part because of the hundreds of helping hands. There was a lot of people on the ground with directions, with bins, with muscles to help people move through. I think it's been a great experience for both of us so far. Yeah. I know there's 180 orientation leaders, but I'm sure there is so many more people helping because everyone on this campus really does love to get involved. The team effort on campus takes planning and coordination throughout the summer. Our residential life team prepares for, for this day all summer long, probably before that. Um, they've perfected it down to dotting all I's and crossing all T's. Working side by side with school officials, UVM's police services. The police chief says they're ready to assist with traffic, safety, and other disruptions to Greater Burlington, but so far so good. There have been years where we've had some backup with traffic uh, and some uh, minor disruption. Uh, generally we don't though, uh, and I think the planning this year is is, is spot on. 18 percent of the college's incoming class comprised of Vermonters, a low percentage compared to other state universities, but still an increase for UVM, with this school year being the first with the Promise program in place. It allows Vermonters within a certain income threshold to attend the university for free. Somewhere between 40 and 45 percent of all Vermonters on campus attend UVM tuition free. The program already helping to improve in-state enrollment with an 8 percent jump in the number of Vermonters in the student body. We've seen uh, more interest in Vermonters, as I said earlier, um, especially Vermonters with high amounts of financial need. Um, we're really looking forward to see what the UVM Promise does in the next two or three years. I think it will really take off then. One of those Vermonters, Jasper Turner, moving from Montpelier. I feel very like at home already. Just It's like the landscape isn't that different and the community feels very welcoming. And this freshman class is bringing lots of other firsts in too. Over 50% of the incoming students are coming from outside New England. And this class is the most ethnically and racially diverse in the school's history. Live in Burlington, Amanda Martin-Ryan, NBC5 News.